too. This is my outfit, top from Zara, skirt, pretty little thing. Um, but I do my mascara. I haven't even put the deodorant on yet, but we'll do that last. Um, I don't know if I want to wear a bendy. I might actually because it looked cute yesterday, and I got compliments on it. Um. Yeah, um, no, no concealer today because yesterday was a disaster. It was like sweating off. It looked terrible. I had to ask somebody for a napkin and take that shit off. So, we're just going to be bare face. And that's alright, I guess. But it will be better if I, like, my skin was clearer, but it's not. Um, so our other cousin is coming with us today um so he's on his way and then we're supposed to leave at like 1 30 or something like that so i'm trying to hurry up do my hair and then pack all my stuff up because i'm going home after the concert so yeah y'all that's it um, yesterday was super fun. The best performance was Rama. I don't care. Like, Rama and Kiki Palmer was good too. Um, who else was it? Rama and somebody else that I liked. Oh, Ice Spice. <laughs> she was good too. I liked her. Think that I be in a Shihamu. Okay, Shihamu. Shihamu. Can I too? I need to take a good picture of the stage for my thumbnail because I totally forgot about that. Okay, y'all. I'm just spray some water on my hair. I'm not going to bring a jacket today because I really just don't have time to be holding that shit because it's hot. So this is the final look. Top Zara. Skirt for little thing. Bag coat. And yeah, no jacket today. We're just keeping it simple. Cute. It's raining outside, so hopefully it won't be too bad. And then I'm just wearing these little raggedy sandals over there because I don't want to get my Sam elements messed up. But yeah, y'all. Broccoli Fest Day 2. Woo! See that I can.
Cherry on top. He was so amazing. Like he does, he has a show in Miami, but no need for that. Like this, 
he I can understand like I love him of course I've been listening to him since like Sonder and like you know since I was in high school and all I can say is he is so worth it you know if y'all want to go to his concert just go buy the tickets honestly it's worth the money um he performed for an hour which is the longest anyone at Broccoli Fest had um I think because he counted Broccoli Fest as like a DC concert so that was like his only time in DC which is why it was so packed and that's why a lot of people came out everybody else well Rilla she was all right no one really knew her music only like the famous ones like people knew um who else Kodak Black was good he was a vibe I'm really trying to oh Asake y'all saw me dancing he would but like he was amazing i was like the only one like turt in the crowd i swear like in the videos there was no one dancing around me so i was just having the time of my life honestly i had jada my cousin recording me the whole time see those people in concert before like they have shows like drake before like it's impossible to see them i'm just super grateful and happy and i got to go for free so yeah one thing i will say about broccoli fest it was very organized. It wasn't ghetto. There was no fights, no no people with guns, no people were so polite when they were like walking through the crowd of like excuse me, sorry, no one had an attitude. It was really hot, but it was cool. They had free water, like free hydration, and the water didn't taste disgusting, so it was alright. The porta potties were fine. I used it like a few times. And then I also got some merch, which I'll show y'all when I go upstairs. The food was like regular carnival food, so it's pretty expensive. Like turkey like $18, lemonade $7, all alcohol drinks were like $15 and up. It was like what you would expect it to be, right? Um, I was drinking a Red Bull and vodka, and then I had tequila and Red Bull. I don't even know what it was, but it was really good. It was broccoli fest. A lot of people were smoking, but I didn't smoke. But um, it was like so overwhelming with the smoke, like everybody. I have never seen so many people smoke at one location, which is crazy. Uh, if you're thinking about going to Broccoli Fest next year, you definitely should go. Just buy the regular admission. Don't buy, I mean, you can buy VIP, but you honestly don't really need it. You're going to still have a really great time. I actually didn't see anybody I knew, which I was super happy about because I didn't have time for that. Broccoli Fest was definitely a 10 out of 10 for me. I have no complaints, honestly. It was... I'm just so, I'm like on a high right now because it's just like, I saw everybody I love. Like, the fact that I saw Rema, I still can't get my head around that. But so yeah, I'm going to end this video. I will show y'all my clothes that I got. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed the videos of all the singers, dancers, the food we got. Yeah, I just ate some egg and bread. <laughs> and I'm about to, I might, I might wash my hair. I'm so tired, but I have to work in the morning. But yeah, one more time with the outfit. Okay, y'all. See y'all later. Love you guys. Please subscribe, like, and comment down below. Bye. Shirts I got. They were kind of, I think they're like $50 a piece. I don't even know, but I didn't pay for it. I don't know who those people are on the front. Probably just some random drawing. Um, the back of the shirts are like the best part. <laughs> Here are the back of the shirts. Here's the lineup. This one will definitely be a sleep shirt because I can't walk out the house. That's too big of a shirt. But this one, when I wash it, it's so cute. When I dry it, it'll definitely shrink. So those are the two things I have for memory.